to GE Creates. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make this sick short trooper. Things you will need a roll of sand colored duct tape, a roll of black duct tape, and a roll of silver. Cardboard, lots. You're going to need scissors, an exacto knife, and a hot glue gun. What I'm going to do is cut a strip. So on your box, you should have a strip like this. It's longer than all the other strips. With that cut, it should fit around your head. Bend the long with corrugation with you. Okay, now we have it corrugated. It should look like this. And when we when we tape it, it will look like this. So we can slide it right onto our head. Now, take your sand duct tape, cut off a piece, lay it lay it on here like so. Lay the other piece like so. And then there you go. Now it's held, almost held together. Take more duct tape and tape this side so that it's fully secure. You could even put Gorilla Tape in the inside to hold it fully together. But I'm saving my Gorilla Tape. Now cut out two, two strips about that long to fit over the helmet to make the dome. Now we have our two pieces cut out. Now let's assemble them. Take your black, because we're doing it on the inside, to hold the top together. Here's how to assemble it. Take your piece, lay it over the top, make sure that it's not too high and it's not like that. Make sure that it's resting right on the cardboard so that it looks really nice and it looks like a nice X. Now, take your Gorilla Tape, put that inside, go inside on the bottom, tape it there, be very careful. And there you go, that's how to assemble it, just do it on the other side. Cut a piece out of a little bit more than a 90 degree angle on the front. Cut the sides off so that it looks like that. And then we get the effect of the long front. So now I'm going to be teaching you how to, how to make the visor. First, take a piece of cardboard about couple inches, about a foot, cut a, over, a little bit more of an oval out, cut it to be about that. Now cut a long a long skinny triangle out of it, bend it, and tape it with your Gorilla Tape or this tape. I'm going to use Gorilla Tape because it holds it together better. Look at that. That ain't coming apart. Gorilla! Now, do the same thing for the bottom. Leave a little bit open on the bottom. Bend it in the middle. You might want to have an adult help you with this part. Now cover it in
can sand tape. And you sand colored duct tape. Now we have this piece done. Now let me teach you how to assemble it to the helmet. One more thing. Take your tape. Spread it across the back side, like so. So that it looks like that. Now, go in the inside because it's going to be sticky in there. Take this tape, go inside, and tape it on the inside so that it's not sticky anymore. Take your visor, set it on, cut a piece of Gorilla Tape, roll it like this, put it in the middle, and then stick it on there, and now we have it held onto that piece. Now take your duct tape, your sand duct tape, tape the visor down. is a good idea. Draw the eyes. I know where my eyes are because I've made helmets long enough that I can just eyeball it and I know where my eyes are. Have someone help you like take a pencil or a pen and mark where your eyes are. Those are where my eyes are. So that's what I want to make it longer than where my eyes are. So I'm going to make it about like this. So you're going to make it up here. It's kind of curved. So stop right in the middle. Make it higher like that. Then you're going to come like this. And you're going to come like that. There you go. There's the eyes you can make it. There you go. There's the eyes you can make them wider or smaller how you need them. Now we're going to exacto knife it out. Carefully, cut sections, cut one section with the exacto knife, and then cut it with the scissors. An adult should help you with this part because it is very, very Detailed and hard to get your scissors in the small corners. I have many, many years of experience making helmets, so I can do it on my own. If you find that the helmet is a little bit too tight, cut a wedge like this. Get a piece of cardboard that will fit right in that wedge. Bend it along the corrugation. And then tape that piece right in there and it will be big. Hold the entire helmet in duct tape except the front piece. Now, here's how to make the breathing pieces. Take a piece about this long, line it right here, about right there. See where you think it looks the best. Now figure out where you want it. Tape it right there where you want it. Do that for both sides. Now we're going to be making the mouthpiece. Take a piece of cardboard, cut it in a half oval like that. Cover it in black tape. Now we're going to be making the little dots. Take another piece of cardboard. Cover that in black. And then cut out little circles. Now, we're gonna take our piece, put some hot glue on it, and then put it with the rounded side up, 
Put it right in between your breathing tubes. And then assemble the dots. One on the, the big one, one on the bottom, and two on the top. It should look like Mickey. Now we're gonna be making that piece. Take a red piece of cardboard or just color a piece of cardboard. Make a circle and then cut a little triangle out of it. There we go. Now we have that piece. Put your piece that you made in the top right hand corner. Hey guys, now we're going to be making the mesh. Take a piece of see-through fabric. I can see the camera. Go on the inside. Lay it down where you want, where, where the eyeballs are. Then take a piece of Gorilla Tape to hold it in. And then do it for the other side, in the bottom and the top. Now our helmet is complete. Thanks for watching JD Creates. Like and subscribe.